Hey there, true believers. Rain Kisaragi with most with Final Fantasy IX. Last time we arrived here in Shrino and turned our Stalazios into other into, into things. Um, unfortunately, I'm missing one of them that I don't think I can get. So that's well, not presently at least. Um, I mean, I may go backtrack off screen to see if I can get the other one, but I have to go find the princess first. Who is not either of these ways that I'm trying to go. I'm very lost right now. Trino's a confusing city. It's a big circle, I realize, but I get very confused. And I apologize for that. I truly do. But this way takes us to where we want to go. So, eventually it takes us to where we want to go. So, so it's, it's all okay in the end, I guess. But here we are at the auction house. You can get some cool stuff here if you have the money to do so, because it's an auction house. <laughs> well, that was, that was kind of mean. <laughs> eh, says maybe. Unlikely, but says maybe. I actually wanted to bid on those fairy earrings, but I don't think they're going to be, uh, available presently. Let's actually see what we got here at the auction house. Griffin's heart, Doga's artifact, Un's mirror. Uh, I don't think we're going to be able to buy any of those. Uh, those first three, three things, you resell them to people in town, and you can make your money back. It's pretty cool. Um, but, yeah, um... Hmm. Um, where am I even going? I'm so lost. I hate Trino. This city sucks. Because I, I get lost and confused. That's all the reason I hate it. Um, yeah, durr. Let's not hold down this time. Excuse me, Red Mage. Oh, did we get do we get Kira new gear? I think we may have got Kira new gear. I should go learn Insomniac from the band now. It's worth it. Um, oh, she actually does need to finish up that first shell first. Okay. Now I want, I'm gonna go take a look to see if I can go grind now. If they'll let me. <clears throat> What's up, Marcus? I didn't think he'd want to come with me. Okay, well, since we are allowed to go and leave and do stuff, I might go see if we can get a thing um, right now. I'm not going to make you guys come along with me for this, because it's going to be quite a bit of backtracking, but we, what we shall see if it's a thing I can do or not. Um, if so, we'll be there. If not, I'll have grinded, and we'll be, and we'll be back right here. Um, so give me but one moment for you guys, and quite a while potentially for me. So give me a moment. All right, here we are in Dolly. Um, I should be able to do this, but there's text, so I figured. Okay, that was it. Okay, never mind then. I thought there'd be more interesting text going on, but yeah, whatever. You got to you got to see that text. Now let's see. Can I get this one now? Please, I can get this one. Oh, sweet, I can. Um, Ares, the Stelazio coin. It's up here. I think I could have got that earlier, but I didn't think I could. So, but we got it now. So, so there. Ha <laughs> ha! We win. Forever. Um, how I got here, because that's going to be something I could at least mention. Uh, that split in the path, I went there, the guard was like, Oh, why do you want to even go to Dolly? Why, are you, why even bother? And I'm like, because I want to go. So then he opened the gate for me. So we're going, which is cool. Um, I'm, I'm going to spare you guys the walk back, though. I just wanted to show you that. That's where Ares is. That is where it is. Um, we'll go back to Trino in a bit. Um, I'm still going to go grind a little bit first. We're not quite... Actually, I can... Mm, now, nah, I'll, 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 I'll show you when I'm, when I'm done with the results. So, give me another moment, everybody. Okay, we're back. I've grinded a little bit. 
We're level 12 and 13 now. Steiner's a little higher because he has a level up still. Uh, as far as equipment goes, uh, Garnet has the Mi Kira rather has the Mithril Rod now. She got a bandana and a bone wrist for the sake of having a better piece of gear. Uh, she's learning Jelly from this because she doesn't need the alchemy, the uh, Cotton Robe, because she already learned Shell from this. Uh, Steiner is just shy of mastering Armor Break, which is good. He has the Barbit because he mastered everything there, and he kind of has mastered gear. Steiner's really good. I'm actually quite happy with how. Um, how competent he's being. But I want to see if, A, if I can do a thing, and B, um, just how well I can do a thing. Okay. Bye, Marcus. We'll go, we'll go mess with Marcus later. Um, I think this is the right way to go. I think. So I think up here leads to the Stelazio house, doesn't it? Yes, okay, good. God, I hate Trino. Remember, because we found Ares back before. Yes, we'll, we'll turn in Ares. Four coins being imprisoned. Then the Ares coins. We got a blood sword. What does the blood sword do? The blood sword is fantastic. It's better than what Steiner has. He learns Dark Side, and whenever he hits somebody, doesn't say it there, but whenever he hits someone, he recovers HP. So we're gonna go ahead and equip that for the time being. There's a reason for this, I promise. And I'm gonna go see if I can do a thing, because there's a thing that I want to do, but I don't know if I'm able to do it anymore. If I can't do it, I'm gonna be very sad, but we'll figure it out when we get there. It's past this giant stadium thing, which we'll learn to hate the stadium later because we have to do a thing there later that I'm not going to be happy doing. But I can suck it, because, well, that's just how that goes. Now, in here, there's a monster down there. Now, I want to see... I want to see if we can fight it with Steiner. Oh, good, we can pick who fights it, because we're going to go have Steiner fight this thing. Go ahead, Steiner. Nope. Oh, oh, bye, Steiner. Now, he should be able to handle this thing now. Now he's been leveled up, he has good gear, he has the blood sword, so he should be able to kill this thing. This is a griffin. This is an enemy from further in the game. That's, yes, okay. Yeah, we'll be fine. <laughs> Steiner's gonna be okay. Yeah, um, the Blood Sword is a very powerful weapon for Steiner. So unless this thing one-shots him, which it won't, we can basically absorb all the damage it does to us. So, it will kill us eventually. Because we don't... Okay. No, if it does tail, it won't kill us. Because we'll just out-heal it. That's why that's, that's that's why I wanted to go get wanted to go see if I can get Ares. See, there was a reason for that. Weirdly enough, guys, there is reason for the things I do sometimes, like this. But, yeah, th this fight's trivial now that Steiner has Blood Sword. This fight is trivial. And there's that. Good job, Steiner. You win the day forever. Could that fight have been made easier? Yes, yes, it could have. As laughable as it is, that fight could be made easier. Sweet, I get a prize? Oh. Well, thanks, I guess. Bitch. Okay, let's take a look at the Tonberry card, because why not? Where is it? Is it over here? I think it's over here. No, it's Frog. Where are you? That's a sword. There it is, Tonberry. He's 1P22. Means he's... crap. Possibly. I don't know. I don't know how to read those cards. I do, but it doesn't matter. Let's give the sign of the, myth, the, the Mithril Sword back. It's because he doesn't need it. Um, so we might as well. There's no reason we won't just go those two. There's no reason not to. Oh, I didn't even have Bird Killer equipped. 
<laughs> Whoops! Yeah, if I had Bird Killer equipped, that would be even easier. Um, yeah, you can make that fight really, really pathetically easy. Um, I kind of want Ord equipped for now. We'll go with Undead Killer, I suppose. I don't know, it's fine. But now that we've done that, that's a lot of what we can do in Trino out of the way. Um, we could go and do the auction house. Actually, let's go take a look at the auction house. Maybe they have something useful for sale that I could pick up. Because I have enough money to actually win something. Let's see. Now let's see if I can actually do a thing. If there's anything useful here, I'll see if I can pick it up. Mini Sid, useless, Doka's, mm, mm, nah. The Mini Sid's a key item. There's a side quest where you collect all the, um, the mini figurines. The the mirror and the artifact, I already said, we, there's, um, there's, there's, you can sell them to people in town. That's it. It's kind of stupid. You can make money, though, but that, that's, that's cool, I guess. Let's actually go down here first. There is a chest, but I don't think we want to open any of these chests right now. Got a wide selection. Okay, what do you got? Crap. Alright, cool. Good selection. Good talk. Let's go. Now we're gonna go we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna go continue the continue the game now. I just wanted to uh, get that all sorted first. Yeah, she's decided she's gonna go with you, Marcus. It's no use arguing. Yep, we are ready. Stomp, 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 stomp. Y yes, the only man he calls boss. There you go. Only one man he calls boss. Boss and bro are very prestigious titles for Marcus. No! I don't wanna! How's it going, Baku? <laughs> yeah, let's go with that. So I can watch you commit this crime that I'll later find you guilty of. That's, and that is Steiner's main conflict, summed up right here. Don't you have any thoughts of your own? Well, he never liked me in the first place, so that wouldn't count him changing much, Baku. Agreed. Let's go before, before this gets existential. But, yeah, that's Steiner's big conflict. Is he... like, does he have thoughts of his own? Hmm. And the auctioneer knows Kuja. This is pleasant. <laughs> oh, he doesn't like Brain either. Huh, our villains hate each other. This is actually a, a cover of a song from Final Fantasy VII. So, there's that. I don't know if Kuja is a man or a woman. I think Kuja is a dude, but I have no proof. Over them. Yeah, I think I'm with Auctioneer here. Uh, 
Oh, he's talking about Garnet, obviously. Well, obviously he does, but it's a very strange person, this Kuja. Oh, that's that's good. It's not ominous at all. Marcus is the only one rowing, then. Is that what's... Yeah, it's just Marcus. Oh, these are Steiner's inner thoughts. I was going to say, whose, whose thoughts are these? They're Steiner's. Well, I wouldn't say never. I have these thoughts here about the things that I'm told. Oh, now we're going to Garnet's thoughts. Yep, it's my fault that you that you put me to sleep. Yep, totally. It's amazing how having a having a great journey like this can change can make you think about things that you wouldn't have thought about. <laughs> well, all right, good. Do it, says Marcus. Probably not loudly like like Shia LaBeouf, but you know. Oh, good. This went tits up pretty quick. Um, he looks fairly innocent. I don't think you should kill him. Yeah, this this isn't a good plan, Kira. Probably go back to hiding. Oh. Oh, okay. Huh, well they're friends then. That's interesting. <laughs> oh, even Steiner knows who this guy is. Fair enough. See, Marcus, it's a good thing you didn't kill him. Oh, there we go then. We're running into a friendly face here in Trino. <laughs> All right, Steiner, just eat, pump, pump the bricks, bud. Good work. Oh. All right. Hmm. 
Well, fair enough then. I guess we can go meet Tot later then. That was a handy little meeting. Tootsie. Yes, Tootsie. That's exact... Shh, Baku. Well, not, not at the mercy. He's helping us, Baku. Probably not, no. <laughs> Just not... Baku, come on, it's taut. It's three letters. It's not even that hard. <laughs> Just think of the best kind of taters. Tots. Anyway, since we're going to go meet him in his lab now, well, not now, but in the next video, uh, this is a good place to end it. So I hope you guys had fun, and I'll see you next time with Mortal Swift Final Fantasy IX. So, till then, till then, 3K.